So five in a row. How are you feeling? Pretty good. <laughs> That's, yeah. yeah, it feels pretty good. Uh, the guys being great in front of me, taking all, clearing all the rebounds that I give, so it's all team effort. I have to thank the guys. What do you think of that guy? <laughs> yeah, he's played unbelievable, and he's continuing to do it. He's been working hard in practice, and it shows what, what's going on in the games. I mean, everything's going well for him, and things are going well for the team, and when he's playing well, we're going to play well, so it's nice to have that defense back there. Three straight sweeps. What do you think has helped this turnaround for you guys? I think uh, we've played some good defensive games. Uh, these last couple games haven't been our best, but I think overall we've played defense really well, and I really think a lot of it comes from Ate is we know that we can count on them if we make mistakes, and so mistakes are going to happen, and we're going to just keep on going with it. You have four straight goals. Do you know that? Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah I, I think Don Tony might have tipped that one in. He, he keeps saying he does. I'm not sure if he does or not, but it's going well, yeah. I think uh, I've had some good uh, conversations with people off the ice. My cousin Nick, I've been talking to a lot, and he, he's given me some life, not life lessons, but life coaching, and it's been good. Uh, getting off ice uh, situated and things going are going really well on ice. Your line's been producing pretty well too. The yeah. Last few games. Yeah, we've we've played really well together. We we have a uh, Diamond Tony's playing unbelievable. He's had well now he has a goal tonight and uh, a couple goals last weekend and he's just been playing really really well. So and, uh Craighead he's been playing well too. So all three of us together has been just it's been really great. Were you thinking about the record at all during the game? Uh, it popped in my head. I'm trying to keep it out of my head, that kind of stuff. But it for sure like came in the third. Like there's like five minutes left. It popped in my head like when we're in the power play. But I was just trying to push that out. Mm -hmm. and there was that almost like a standing ovation from everyone. It was part of the team, but a lot of people were, were praising you and, and your play, especially on a night when I think they had almost like 50 shots on you. Yeah, it's awesome. Like, get a little recognition from the crowd, and like, I would say it's for for the whole team. It's like the guys been doing so good in front of me, so they've been helping me so much. Yeah, this penalty kill is pretty impressive tonight. Yeah, those guys have been unbelievable. We we've, we've been taking way too many penalties, and that's an issue that we're going to shore up here this week. We're going to really work on it, and into the end of the rest of the year, we can't be taking as many penalties as we have. But we have those guys. We have Dom. We have Shane. We have Pascarook. We have. Denny, they're all playing just unbelievable defensively in the D zone, and their four checks are great uh, on the penalty kill. It's hard for them to get in and set up, so it's been going really well for us. You guys have climbed into fifth place in the standings right now. What do you think is the key to keep that going? Uh, I mean, good goaltending. <laughs> <laughs> no, we just, we just have to show up uh, every game. So, like, we have four games left, so we it's four, four hard bot, fought battles. Like, they're both both teams are like top in the standings, so. It should be good, good games. At the beginning of January, do you guys think you would be in this position right now? I think, uh, I, yeah, I think we are actually. We, we the whole year we knew we were a good team and we knew we had the players that can play. And things were just weren't bouncing our way. Things were the puck goes in here, a puck bounces funny here, and we don't get goals and we're getting scored on fluky. And it's it's something that we knew was going to come around, and it was just a process to get here. And I think everybody thinks the same thing. I, Thanks, six wins in a row, but the story is probably Ate and his fifth straight shutout. Well, Ate was, uh, yeah, that is the story for sure. I mean, uh, sometimes you win games you maybe don't deserve to win. If, if, you're, if you're a good team, that happens sometimes. And I thought two things. I thought we got some of our top players very tired last night killing penalties, and then we had to come right back again tonight, and we did the same thing. And those guys got tired. They've been off. I give those guys a lot of credit because they've been off a ton of ice time and did a good job killing. But at the end of the day, we made Ate make too many saves. Um, and we were fortunate. We got some opportunities to score in for Robbie Payne. You know, so um, that was good. And I think that uh, you know, in, in the second, they bombed us. But when you look at this, a lot of it was outside. There weren't great chances. I was happy with that. I think they did a decent job with that. We just didn't do a very good job forechecking tonight. We didn't do a very good job in the offense. It was almost possession. We did have some chances that we, again, that we took advantage of. Um, you know, we got to keep out of the box. I can tell you that's the biggest thing I'm going to you know, take out of it. Because we, we got to continue to have success if we're going to be in and do what we want to do. We keep asking him about the record and the streak, but he's always one to just deflect yeah. and, and, and. Yeah, that's what he should do. I mean, the, the reality is, it's not, it, it is not about the record right now. It's, not, it, it, it's about us winning games, and that's what it is about. And he's a, Ate's a wonderful kid with a great attitude. 
Uh, he's had a, an exceptional year. He, he started out, he had, I thought he had a very average first half, and to be able to come back and rebound and keep his head in and do the things that he's done, I think is outstanding. The guys, you know, we have a good, we have a close team. The guys care about him, but the end of the, and I take cares about them. At the end of the day, it's about winning. He knows that's really the only number that counts right now. Pain's